Hello and welcome to Geek at Play Studio Tutorials. In many times user when using SketchUp application previously they may have some challenge to export OBG model from the SketchUp and import inside the Vue application. Recently Eon Software released plugin which allowed to export from SketchUp to Vue directly. And what I want to do in this tutorial, I want to look on this plugin how we can install it and how to use it. It's very easy to use app application, very straightforward and we can look on this. You can find this um, plugin available on Carnacopia 3D and it's a SketchUp for Vue exporter which is actually will work for um, SketchUp 7 or 8 for your Pro as well as on Mac or Windows. So after you purchase the application you will have a zip file allowed to you and we can look right here and this is a zip file you have it there um, of course our guides how to install it, which is very straightforward but we're going to do this anyway in tutorials just to see it we also have a two directories one is a SketchUp where we need to go ahead and take this information and copy inside the plugin directory of your SketchUp as well we have some scripts that we need place it inside the Vue Python directory and Python lib. Okay, so let's look. Example right here, let's look on the Vue. And by the way, if you're using Vue 64 bit, SketchUp will be um, 32 bit that will work very well together. So let's go ahead and example. Here we have a directory of a Vue. Currently it's Vue 9. And you can see inside the Python. We have a python lib and all what we need to do just go ahead inside our python lib we'll copy these files and copy them inside our location again depend on installation on your machine if you're on a pc or mac that location can be different but overall you just need to take this file and copies in your python lib directory of your vue installation so let's go ahead a little bit up right now. Now we look on SketchUp. So if we go on SketchUp plugins, okay, and let's look on this directory right here. You can notice we go and can Google SketchUp, and we go inside the plugin directory, and we also already copy these files. We have a Vue export directory as well. We'll need to copy RB file. We export right here. So you just select these two files and copy in your plugin directory okay currently just ask if i want override i'll just cancel because we will already install it this way but overall it's very easy that's all all what you need to do to install that uh, plugin okay let's go ahead now inside the sketchup right here i have a test um some building i loaded and the nice things about Vue, you can find, or about SketchUp, you can find in a warehouse, model warehouse, you can find a lot of different models that are realistic to the, um, from Google Earth or other locations or when other people use it. As well, you can um, just create your own, which is, um, we will have some tutorials on how to create it. Or it's very many other tutorials available online, how to build in SketchUp the buildings or other models. So to export, you will notice at this point, you'll have it um, direct plugins. So a menu, we can click down and now we have it Vue export. And the Vue export will have it export full model, export selected, also some help and about the plugin information. If you want export just selected objects without full scenery, you want just select export selected. For right now, for this purpose, I just want to use the export full model. Okay, and we'll just go ahead and maybe name this house. It's all what we need to do. We just save it. Next, let's go inside the view. And what we need to do is just going and actually load it object. Because plugin is saved as the VOB format for this our object, we don't need to use it export. So let's go ahead and click on load object. 
we'll go and this is not in our library so we need go open browse and we'll go to the house and you notice right here we have it VOB also when we export it we have an additional directory with the textures was creating for us let's open open our model it's take maybe second depend on complexity of your object to um, load it and for this tutorial currently we're using a VU9 this is plugin will work with VU8 as well okay right here we have it, our model loaded let's reposition so I won't bring smooth a little bit up higher okay and you know what let's drop down a little bit so we'll go directly to the um, ground level you can notice we have it all our components everything is exported on that selection or full model that's what we selected at the time next we'll go select our camera and now we can start working with all um, presets where we have it also you know what let's select the model we have it and I just want maybe rotate it so we can see the side view again it's depend on complex or how many objects and currently actually we have it very nice we have it 117 polygons but um, sometimes your system may be a little bit less responsive depend on how much memory it's taking okay let me readjust slightly so I want to see um, all the way view okay we'll go ahead still save on a preview and we'll go render on a screen okay right here you can see we have it our model exported model now render and we're fully ready to use also notice our textures they apply correct um, in some cases uh, when previously you export as Colado or you export as different type sometimes texture does not apply correctly um, right now it's uh, the plugin handle very well on this so I can and of course when you export in Vue we maybe want to rep replace these trees with a Vue trees that will respond to the wind everything but overall here's our model and you can see how it's very simple to install and export all models and sets from the sketch up to Vue in our next tutorials we'll look on a little bit more extended export which will include a lighting sun position and a camera thank you for watching this tutorial from geek at play studio